And as we continue to learn more about this crash, not on your side, visited the Beaufort Carteret County community today to see how citizens are taking in this tragedy. That's right. Our Claire Malay joins us live now from just outside of East Carteret High School, where some of the people aboard the plane attended school. Claire, how are people in that area feeling today? Yeah, Ken, Angie, according to several Facebook posts as well as community members, many think that some of the some of the people aboard that uh, plane did attend East Carter at high school and many community members I spoke to today were really too shaken up to even speak to the camera. But I did talk to a few and they all say at this time their hearts are just with those who may be affected. Carteret County School says they are deeply saddened and are providing crisis teams on their school campuses to offer support for students and spoke to some locals in the area who say they are shocked and devastated. Anna Woodard has lived in Beaufort for five years. She says while she didn't know anyone in the crash, she has a lot of close friends that did know some of those involved. Well, and I'm trying to get emotional because I am a mother of a five-year-old and I just don't think that any parent should have to lose their child. You know, the fact that we lost so many, you know, in one incident, it's just heartbreaking. I think if we uh, if we just support the families even after everything dies down and, and do some nice things for them. Several locals I spoke to also mentioned that they hope there will be plans to somehow honor the students as a community. Coming up at 6, we will have the full statement from Carteret County Schools as well as more from the locals. Live in Carteret County, Claire Molay, 9 on your side. Claire, thank you.